Western universities are increasingly looking at foreign markets for growth and for financing. For years, institutions like Georgetown University, while Cornell Medical School, have operated outposts in the Persian Gulf. Lara Sotrakian is with us now to take a look at the very latest. This is New York University launching a full liberal arts campus in Abu Dhabi. Lara. Deirdre, this could be a bailout or a kind of stimulus for NYU. Abu Dhabi covers the full cost of that campus, plus generous financial aid packages for students, plus a $50 million gift to NYU. Now, universities are always in the business of fundraising, and that's been very difficult in this economy. And as you just heard, falling asset prices are cutting into their endowments. And that's a metric where NYU already had catching up to do compared to other first-tier universities. NYU's endowment is estimated at $2.5 billion. That's around $50,000 per student compared to Harvard's $1.3 million per student and Princeton's $1.7 million. Now this is also a kind of bailout for the students of NYU Abu Dhabi. Those generous financial aid packages run as high as more than $62,000. Compare that to the average student at NYU's home campus that walks away from college $35,000 in debt. And, I mean, Lara, a lot of educators and analysts see this as a pretty smart move for NYU. Uh, how is that so? But well, we are hearing that, that this isn't just about raising money. It's about raising their game. NYU is really breaking away from the pack and making a major global investment well before any of its competition. It's a kind of product differentiation. They talk about being a global network university. So each campus would be a kind of portal into a movable education where you could spend each semester across 16 planned campuses around the world. That's a very unique offering to prospective students. And it also exports American higher education. So they're really opening themselves up to a world of applicants, which is a very smart move in the business of education.